one to the building here. We got Zerks versus Jin, and we got Austin Champion. Oh, I play Roy. You play it Fire Emblem, huh? Roy's our boy. It's because he's our fire. Boy. <laughs> I like Roy. I don't, I'm gonna be honest with you, but when I play Smash, I just Smash, so I really don't know what any of these boys are. Hey, you can't smell, you can't spell Smash you can't without smash. mash. You need that. Wait, that's not true. Little uh, mashed potato. But right now, I think we're gonna just see a Fire Emblem classic. This one's gonna be Sword Fight. It's gonna be on guard. Yo, I love Sword Normals. They're my favorite kind of normals. Spot dodge to the fine, and he went back off the ledge. You know, I never gave you enough credit. Uh, you really taught me what Uchi Uchi was, and I, I've loved it ever since. And that, this game, I believe, is going to be lots of good <laughs> I feel like Smash, once it's competitive, is definitely a neutral heavy game, for yeah. sure. Yeah. Multiverse is helping me with my neutral. Also being able to, you know, extrapolate on your touches. You know, you really need to make when you get that opportunity to get some damage racked up for it to count in nice Ooh. back air there to clean up stock number one. Oh, There's a bit of a ledge jump as well. So just gets him off the ledge and then sends him on his way. Jin, next level stuff right there. All right, then once again, you can see how important neutral is here. They're just both jumping behind each other. Yeah. You can see bear, fair, all that. Nice recovery spot dodge once again. Finding its way. He's out here. Perfect little soul read there coming out from Zerx. Knew exactly what Jin had lined up and is able to get a nice little bit of damage here on this stock number two as well. Okay, and runs it back. He said, Oh, you can do two neutrals? I can do two neutrals. Mm -hmm. Okay, about to be back on. What is, it's fencing, right? I never remember. I always remember on guard, but I never remember fencing. They're just fencing, right? Mm, mm, great shield. Into the back throw. Okay. Follow it up, but I'm coming to get you. He said, and, yeah. Uh, yeah. He said, nay, I'm still here. Nay. See, so like, Krom in that situation, not coming back. But Roy luckily oh, has no. a bit of grip. But there. Jin presses up B just a little bit too late there. Had the ability to get back, but might have been spooked a little bit by Xerxes' movement. But I think Jin will clean it up here. 105. And he said he's got a new controller. Last time I seen him on Twitter. Oh no, he didn't break the controller before he got here. Well, he might have. He said he was high, hyped. So we'll see. There's round three as well. So both of these cats not wanting to drop to lower right here. This is a really important match for both of them. I don't even think the first game like. Oh! He's still living though. Nah. Not anymore. Yeah, I, I think Jin will clean it up in game two. I don't even think the first game is really going to show us anything. But what it is going to do is put Xerx, uh, one of the very good players of uh, sorties here in the valley, up by one. Yeah, and, you uh, say not going to show nothing. I see the scoreboard going up. What, Nikki? What are you? What are you actually I'm just yapping? Say, I'm saying, J I'm saying, Jin got these two games, and it, it, you know, Zerk shouldn't feel like he did too much there. But uh, that shirt is winning uh, shirt of the day for me. <laughs> So <laughs> the shadow shadows on the search, <laughs> but you know exactly what for. No, I just read the shirt. Like, yo, shadow is really just out here. <laughs> shadows right. out here, and so are we. We already started on the second match. Yeah, once again, neutral so important. Just gonna go straight two upbees out of shield for Jin to get a clean 36%. Two neutral airs. Ooh, they're clinging. They're parrying. Like it's a true that. sword fight. It's That's a real true. friendship. <laughs> Sitting in the pocket with the homie, just power shielding. I found, and I found two sticks, and they belong to this tree, and now we're sword fighting. <laughs> oh, so follows up. Chasing him, and he's out of here. Get, get on out of here, brother. Yeah, that was a quick stock, and only 35% being able to be racked up in rebuttal thus far. But now, yeah, look nah. at Zerx really laying it on. Yes. There we go. Zerx is landing these hits that are just next level, man. Yeah. Jinx definitely wants to get this damage up as much as he can before he loses the stock. So I Ooh, think he wants to be a little bit more careful, but that there we was... go, finds the hit and the Pele to follow it up. That was so smart. Jin knows I can just kind of land behind this third up B, and his up are coming out a little bit faster than Zerx are because of uh, character bias. Oh, I'm uh, I don't know what just happened. Uh, he, he, he countered him at the ledge and then he sent him on his way packing. Gonna lose, no, not gonna lose his first stock and uh, is gonna air dodge, get back to the ledge. Nice shielding, a B out of shield is gonna make it hard for Zerx to not get three stocks here. And uh, Austin was talking, I was yapping, but all of a sudden it's looking like Jin to win. Yeah, your degree of gapology is about to be revoked, my guy. You might be uh, out here spitting facts indeed. Uh, what in the room? Oh, okay, so that's when you, uh, you, uh, you, you take your 
stock, and then you take their stock same time. I thought that's you were the, supposed to do that when you're up. Though. No, that's the that's the I'm not getting three stocked in my own house after I win. So we're just gonna take it to game three. And that's your deep analysis for Roman and Nick. So so deep. Um, <laughs> Uh, so Jin takes game two pretty handily, almost a three stock, if you will. I think it's a three stock because Chrom dies first, right? Or no? no. He has to. Because you could JV? just you could just cheese if that's JV one. Yeah, that's the JV three. A little JV three to end off game two. And speaking of threes, we're in game number three now as an early onslaught of pressure coming out from Zerks and justly rewarded 63%. A little bit more to add on top as. Mm. Jin is finally getting some licks back in this scrap, but yeah. oh my goodness! Ah, that is a uh, stock on. So there goes all my waffles. There goes everything. Yeah, you're you're definitely waffling. Oh, now he's, now he's turning it up. Shout he out says, to Young that Waff. Three, that three stock was just a was just a fake. Oh my goodness! Yeah. Wait. I, now Jin has to turn it up because yeah, uh, Zerks brought something different to game two, three, four. Where are we? Are we playing multiverses? <laughs> back to the ledge again. It's going to oh. be able to every time just counter this wherever he nice. wants, is able to make it back, but so is Zerg. No, he's not. Yeah, no, just a little bit off too low. Yeah, that just kind of felt unfair. You know, if you think, let's run it right. back. That's what Poyo does to me. No but axe. There's your fairness right there. Two uh, Zerks is going to get another stock, and now Jin is going to have to put on one of those combos that Zerks did, and I don't know if he's got it in him right now. Ooh, right now? Dang, you say he don't got those? I mean, he and the, in the time of need, in his hour not to a, beat the champion, I'm you saying he don't got champion tactics? That's crazy. That was He got boy. this. He got this. Does he? Oh. Tripping him, slipping him. Uh oh, I thought he was going coast to coast with it's that. But. Okay, here we go, Pele. Up, up, and away. Where are we going? Oh, he said, get off that. Okay, look at the neutral from Jin. Oh, nice spot dodge. Get that grab away from oh. me. Bounce. Go. 122, and you still need to get this man off. Oh, he poked him. Head. Yeah. 122 and two stocks to oh. get through, bro. Oh. He killed him. Yeah, he's out. A little poke. Yeah. That ledge wasn't feeling too. Grippy, grippy, grab that. You gotta grab that. Oh, is he dead? Uh, he is. I mean.